Before we get back to the wrestling aspect of your career, which I'm sure you want to really talk about more than this drama, um, the, the video that you guys made, the One Night in China, whose idea was that, and how did that all come about, and how pissed were you? The uh, odd part was is that, you know, I told, told you about going on talk shows or uh, um, reality shows or Howard Stern, and so uh, I had gotten this idea. I had my own home video of, um, you know, my friends or Sean and I doing silly stuff, right. karaoke, playing with the guitars, you know, slammed, doing some funny things, a couple promiscuous things, um, but meant for personal use and something funny. Uh, I don't even think any of it was ever watched back, but I remember taping it or, you know, funny stuff. Uh, but um, my intentions were, and this is really bizarre, um, I kind of had a hold on the reality show. This is before I started doing the reality shows because the wrestling, in a sense, it was not, you know, re reality became this whole new phenomena. But I'd been in an athletic reality, not reality, you know, Right. Is it real? Is it not real? For my my career, you know. So I got reality TV like that, you know. No big deal. Well, the funny thing was is that I was being real, and so I thought, gosh, you know, let's just have my own reality show, you know. And because we had so much fun and we're so in love and all the stuff or whatever, the passion or the fighting or whatever. Right. You know? And so I started filming a lot of that. Well, I got, went on uh, Howard Stern and, you know, I'd always come up with a new idea. I mean, at first it was a band and then I would right. have a song and then I was <laughs> doing this and, I, you know, so I was, you can't blame me for trying here. That's cool. <laughs> but, um, so, uh, of course, and Howard's during nature and in the listening nature, Howard said, you know, ah, is it, you know, sex tape? And uh, I would say, well, you never know. Hmm. You just have to, you know, wait and see. And in my mind, I'm thinking, you Gina. know, huh, you know, well, do you, I'm probably putting right in somebody's head, like, hey. That'd be fantastic. Right. Um, long story short, because I in no way want to promote it, have I collected a dime from it. I consider that to be Sean's tape. He literally went to the country of China with his people, who I d uh, do not know, did his thing, met with Red Light District. I d don't know... I'm going to end it there okay. because I don't know anything about that, but it was a horrible embarrassment, infringement, um, uh, violation that I uh, took me uh, another notch in the belt to really get over. Did you have to fight legally or it uh, wasn't worth it? I, I, I tried, but at this point I just, what? you know, I, I'm, I, I'm just not, I'm just not going to go there and what happened happened and like I said, you have to be good with you ultimately in the end of the day and, and move on from it.